gaat je nog alleen Dad was not philosophical. He was a doer. As a teenager, I once probed him. Dad, what is your philosophy of life? He answered me, the next thing and then the next thing. He met Anna Whitner at a wedding and was smitten. He asked her, when you grow up, will you marry me? <laughs> Two years later, she did. That bond, that love would only grow deeper. As he said years later, I look at her with wonder. And then his eyes would invariably fill with tears. For anyone who knew Zelman, it was indeed the great, inspiring love affair. Her Excellency the Governor-General has spoken of how, when she invited Vice-Chancellor Cowan at short notice to lecture to one of her law classes at UQ at that time, his was the best lecture she has ever heard earning a standing ovation from the students. The greatest cricketing moment in the life of one of our friends was achieved the day he was dismissed court aide-de-camp bold Governor-General. <laughs> he loved each of his children, Simon, Nick, Kate and Ben, deeply. He loved to tell the stories of their brilliance in disagreeing with him or their apparent indifference to the great affairs of state in which, was, in which he was preoccupied for much of his time. He once wrote, I reflect on a life that has been blessed by good fortune. I have had remarkable opportunities to serve the communities to which I belong and about which I care deeply. In doing so, I have had the strong support of my wife. Perhaps more poignantly, with the air of the inevitable finality, he said, the small boy did not dream all of this. It was far beyond the scope of any dream. It was what happened, and I am deeply grateful. So there. We have it.